The Congress unveiled its comprehensive manifesto for Rajasthan Assembly polls, presenting a commitment to conduct a caste survey and introducing various schemes for farmers and youth. Key promises include creating 10 lakh job opportunities, implementing a new recruitment scheme at the panchayat level, and doubling the Chiranjeevi health insurance scheme's annual benefit from Rs 25 lakhs to Rs 50 lakhs. The manifesto also pledges reservations for minorities based on their population post the caste census. Jointly released by Congress leaders including President Malikarjun Kharge and Chief Minister Ashok Gehlot, the manifesto highlights the party's vision to establish a Panchayati Raj cadre akin to state and central services, emphasizing the creation of 10 lakh jobs with a substantial portion in the government sector. The manifesto focuses on inclusive policies and empowerment at the grassroots level. For farmers, the Congress promises interest-free loans up to rupees 2 lakhs from cooperative banks and adherence to the Swami Nathan Commission's recommendations on minimum support price. The manifesto also outlines plans for enhanced employment under MGNREGA, the inclusion of taxi drivers in the Gig Workers Act, and the introduction of the Accountability and Auto Service Delivery Act for good governance. Seven guarantees previously announced by Gehlot are reiterated in the manifesto, covering diverse aspects such as an annual honorarium for women heads of the family, subsidized LPG cylinders, dung per for cattle rarers, the reinstatement of the old pension scheme for government employees, and provision of old laptops or tablets for students, insurance cover for natural calamities, and the English medium school education. Kharge asserted that all promises made in the manifesto would be fulfilled upon the formation of Congress government, emphasizing their commitment to deliver on realistic pledges. He criticized Prime Minister Modi and the BJP for what he deemed a lack of commitment, citing persistent shortcomings in Gujarat. Gehlot highlighted Rajasthan's economic growth under Congress rule, aiming to achieve a target of Rs 30 lakh crore by 2030. Gehlot emphasized the Congress's adherence to its manifesto as a governing document, reinforcing the party's commitment to fulfill promised initiatives. With Rajasthan heading to the polls on November 25th, the results are expected on December 3rd.